Well, here again we have another one of those really dense uh, aerial root clusters coming down midway up on the trunk of this um, the sign bee tree. But I really wanted to demonstrate the fact that not only are these aerial roots coming down, presumably to eventually reach the forest floor and fortify the pseudo trunk, and possibly to catch through fall nutrients from precipitation. But one of the most amazing things, which I believe is undocumented anywhere else in the world, that these totally aerial root mats in this tree become act heavily ectomycorrhizal. And this is a wonderful example of these big, thick descending roots that are heavily ectomycorrhizal with Tomentella species. It has a brown, dense hyphal weft. We've sectioned these. We've also done DNA work on them. It's definitely a Tomentella. And they become heavily mycorrhizal as they're descending through space, hanging out in air. Whether this is also related to potential nutrient capture from through fall, we can only hypothesize. But one thing is for sure, these big fatty roots become heavily mycorrhizal. And I've shown you earlier the black uh, strigos ectomycorrhizal on these aerial descenders uh, that we've sequenced actually. And it's also a Tomentella species, different than this brown one.